to the Scotia Pass. Say no to the vaccine passport. We definitely have a problem. Yes. We yes. the uh, the pass to actually eat food, to actually grocery shop at some point, to live means that you have to be vaccinated. There's some problems with that. I have a big problem. You get to go to church, you have to be vaccinated. Um, yeah, I have issues with all of those things. My family left a communist country to come to Canada so that I, their daughter, could have a better life. And I'm sure that they did not imagine that Canada would become communist. Right, yes. I'm concerned about the violation of our charter rights. Uh, we have the right to security of our person by uh, Section 7 of the Charter and vaccine mandates and restrictions requiring persons being mandated to partake in various normal activities are a violation of those rights. Sorry, there was an error with your broadcast. I'm going to screenshot that. Nobody here has any ill will. We have no bad intentions, but you cannot lock the public out of a publicly accessible building. We'd like you to come and open the gates, please. Then you need to bring someone out here, because I've informed the police officer here. And he's going to come and educate you that you cannot lock the public out of a publicly accessible building and grounds. You have no authority, you have no right. You need to come and open the gates, sir. They don't really care about us. And I'm concerned about some serious side effects that the vaccine is known to uh, cause in people. This man, his job is to uphold the law. You cannot lock the public out of a publicly accessible building and grounds. The voter, like the idea of her joining the Liberals. I don't think anyone should be forced to take those kind of chances with their life and their health. I think if someone wants to take those risks, it's totally their choice and it should not be forced upon anybody. Officer, can you bring a staff sergeant down, please? Fantastic. An officer. I, am, I do apologize that you've been put in this position because we haven't put you in this position. This man here has put you in this position. I mean, a security guard couldn't physically remove me. They would have to call the police, have me trespassed, to have me physically removed. They could absolutely. So this is a public building paid for by public tax dollars. It is fully publicly accessible. These gates are never closed. It is really good. All I want to say is that they don't really care about us. They don't really care about All I want to say is that they don't really care about us. Oh, I didn't mean to wait for that. Okay. I can, I can That's all right. You're, you're the it's one dangerous. Yeah, you're, right. one, you're the oh, one that okay. called those ladies a C word over there. Oh, did he? Yes, he did. And so am I. But, but but if we I let this support, slide, no, it's a, no. You're getting sidetracked. No, I'm not. No, because because if we let this slide, 
if, if, if we say that, that the Charter of Rights don't matter for that, then they don't matter for this too. I'm really not, and I and I appreciate where you're coming from, but I'm not. I'm really not. I'm sounding like a broken record now. Anywhere we choose to see fit, this is not a private building. We would like the gates open, please. Nobody has any bad intentions. Nobody has any ill wills. Yeah. And it became about a gate being shut. Because yeah. They didn't feel safe. That's what it became. That's so, what I see. So, 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 and again, please don't take this the wrong way. You're not the feelings police. No, absolutely not. You are the and, law. Right. And we didn't. And right we didn't now, lock the gate, yeah. And, we and didn't shut the gate. And Charter of Rights and Freedoms. Last time I checked needs right. to be upheld. It needs to be upheld, yeah? And right now, they are violating, violating every single one of our rights. Yep. Charter of Rights. So what recourse do we have? Well, you take it to court. So now the, so now the, so, so what you're saying is, is that, is that if I'm, if, 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 if I run out and I go, emergency, something, oh, she, she can just go, nah. No, she won't do that. But she's doing it to me. So how does she know that I don't have an emergency? She hasn't come over and, and, and spoken Again, to me. Gary, I think oh, you're come just, on. You're fading the content for this, for the cameras. So I don't, I don't, get, I don't want the cameras here. Like, Thank you for being here because the media is not here. They show up, but they don't show anything on television. They're not representing uh, the population. They're only representing what the narrative is, and we're really disappointed in that. That truth no longer stands tr as truth in Canada. Tough crowd.